Hello everyone, welcome back to some more Let's Play Halcyon 6 with me, your host Tim. Alright, let's get back into the game and pick up where we left off. I think we had just attacked a new Terra, yes, and we were successful at that. And our ships are leaving intact, in fact, we were so successful. So holy crap, good for us. And I guess we're probably coming to all these places to pick up the things which are left out here on our way back home. And here, I think it, at Halcyon 6, I believe we're busy making drones. Yes. Yep. And as well, working on dark matter creation. And I think we're also bringing back a new... A new officer as well that we've successfully rescued. Also, congratulations, like we say, Nay. You've leveled up. So, what are we taking? We probably should take one of these up a rank. And I use both of these a lot. So why don't we take Dimensional Flashbang? There we go. Okay, cool. Next, uh, let's just pass by some time. And actually, is there anything else I need to do? No, I don't think so. We're just waiting for time because I want enough dark matter so I can research Tier 3 ships and then produce a Tier 3, tier three Science Vessel, which I'll commandeer, passing on the Tier 2 I'm using to... Nadir here, and then we can send out a group of tier twos around to collect things. We'll have two squads able to to do things, and who have we gained? Crewman Trace, plus two evasion. You know, we may want to actually build another one of these weird buildings that I've been avoiding. We have enough- no, because I need the room for a tier three starship hangar. It'll be six days before I'll have a squad of three. Because I really do want to build, or I'd love to research a cadet barracks and a ship repair bay. Oh wow, we can also research a troll lab. Oh, that sounds handy. It reduces research costs and enables the new troll-related tech. But I need so much dark matter to do that. I'm not sure what to do, so... But I should start something now? No, I, I don't need to. We're just, we're just gonna wait. Once people are done with their current activities, we'll wait till we have a group of three people? Actually, no, because I need a level 7 to clear the next rooms, and I don't have any level 7s at the base at the moment. All my level 7s are out in space. And wow, we're going right back to Halcyon 6, apparently. The first satellite drone is ready to be deployed. An officer is required to configure the satellite at a colony facility. All right, let's wait for these people to come back, and we'll send out um, Crusader Cassandra, Hyben, and Nadir. We'll all be sent out to deploy that somewhere. Probably at one of these colonies, so I don't ever have to come back there again. Nadir successfully created 30 Dark Matter. I'll acknowledge that, and we're just going to pass by time to get back to... The oh, hello! We got 62 crew, 175 materials... Commander Debrief, the return home. The destruction we found at New Terra was, in a word, total. We can only imagine the kind of instantaneous cross-dimensional attack that made this devastation possible. The threat we're facing with these trolls is unlike any other we faced, though it may be hard to comprehend, we are all that's left of the once peerless Federation Navy. We do have one reason to celebrate. We managed to rescue Zulfqueer Zulf Maddox, the legendary inventor, who was commanding a team of engineers on the Oristus moon when the attack struck. Perhaps other legendary officers are, too, out there, clinging to survival, waiting to be rescued. For now, all we can hope to do is protect the few remaining Federation facilities still active, build up our fleet, and push back against this troll armada. Oh, he's an engineering officer. I guess that makes sense. Though, I was hoping for a science officer. I could also rename him, but I don't know what, know what to rename him. So he has four of, th of these abilities and four ground combats. I have to. I have no choice but to select him as well. So what does he have? EMP Overcharge. Oh wow, tries to disable all the enemy ships. That's pretty nice. He can heal himself. He can ram an enemy. And death from above. That's, a, that's decent. Electrocute... Skirmish Hammer. 
Ghost Pepper Bomb. So he can't heal himself here, but he can use Ghost Pepper Bomb to hit all the enemies for some damage. And he can taunt. I thought he, I thought he was a science officer. I didn't realize he was not, but he is a legendary. Yeah, so he'll have the Oh, he has an epic EMP overdrive. Is his epic? Okay. Well, darn it. I really want another science person so I can keep pumping out dark matter. Alas, we do not have this have such. All right. So, we're going to take his first three abilities in these skills. So, I'm thinking that's a pretty decent disable, even 100% damage. Why don't we take a quick tune-up? Ramming speed's nice. Got all that damage, although the whole breach would kind of stink. We'll take death from above. And then maybe a ground power. Actually, no, we should, we should take a rank two. There's far more space combats that happen out here. So then, do I, which of these do I want? Let's take the death from above. Repair specialist, whatever that does. Obsessive, very old. That sounds bad. <laughs> Zekir Zolfmatics is a brilliant, though eccentric inventor who spends much of his time perfecting what most people consider to be highly obsolete technologies, such as nuclear kitchen knives and nuclear dishwashers. He thinks they're pretty neat, though. Good for you, good for you, Zolf. Good for you, sir. Okay. We're basically kind of waiting for Cassandra to come back. Who was busy doing dark matter replication. Wow, was I that desperate? I think I was. So, I will sit in here and work on dark matter... Dark matter 3. We need 150 Dark Matter all the time. Nadir, you are level 3? Okay. We're gonna have Nadir pilot my ship. So, the Cruel Angel will remove this officer and assign... Oh no, I, you have to be level 7. To even pilot it. Oh, wow. That's really awkward. And what's this fleet consist of? Oh, man. All tier twos. And I think this is a tier three ship. I'll want to defeat them. But I can't send a rank one out. There's no way we'll win against that. Yeah, this is a tier three and two tier twos. I'm not ready for this. We really need tier three vessels. But it's going to be a lot of dark matter to even research it. And then we need to build the ships, which are probably even more dark matter. Okay, let's send out... We might as well send out a crew begin deploying these drones of ours. I really can't afford to send out a rank 1. I simply can't afford to do that. Oh, he probably needs to be rank 4, Tim, to fly a tier 2. Probably rank 7 for tier 3s is probably how it works. Okay, so... Okay, we can set up the ghost ship, since it's got repair drone. And repair drone overdrive, so you'll come along Hyben. We'll take... I guess we'll take, then... Do I want the Dragon's Talon? And the Special Snowflake? We could bring Lottery's Luck. It's so dangerous, but we could give this a try. We're not a match for the, the fleet that's out there, though. We'd have to take on anything else with this fleet. Or we could just continue to have Nadir just constantly pump out... Resources, and that will eventually level him up. You know what? We'll do that instead. We'll deploy the Dragon's Talons. So this will be our squad. And we're not going to go to battle, not without a science vessel to heal us. 
And that will be aggressive, passive aggressive response. I'm gonna get rid of these two. And then we're gonna send this fleet out to begin gathering resources. So let's do that. Oh, Crusandra, you're you know what? I'm just gonna launch you. And then in a dark matter multiplier, I think no, we can only still only do rank ones with you, Nadir. And we can begin clearing some more space out with everyone else. My engineering officers are now gone, so now it's going to be a little slower to build more drones. Michael Janice, you'll clear this room. Four days? I could hold on to Zulf. We're going to fight some really strong things in there. I'm a little nervous that we'll fight things that we're not a match for. But I guess we'll see what happens. And we'll have matter replication with you, Zulf. Okay, that's good. I'll probably just try to flee if we end up fighting anything in a rank 7 area. All I have is cadets. I don't have anything stronger. So I definitely don't need anyone to come and... Uh, we don't need to deploy a drone at these locations. Oh, it just occurs to me. One of these locations could head over here to grab the crew and then begin killing everyone. I'd have to immediately get my tier 2 ship out of there and try to, re and try to stop this from happening. The, everything around here is already done. I want to pick up all this... Oh! The exploration team has run into a wounded alien creature. While exploring this alien station, Michael Janus and their assigned crew have come across a unique sight. A newborn grombulus blinker. Nearby the rotting carcass of what must have been its mother. Kill it dead! Dispatching the newborn blinker proves relatively easy. However, soon after, the seemingly dead Grumbless Mother opens its massive central eye and darts in to attack. I don't think we can do this. Let's see how many hit points it has. Nope, we're we're doomed. We have we have, we've got to run. We're gonna retreat immediately. <laughs> Yep, we're no match for that. The Grombulus mother managed to drive back her crew. This area is now filled with Grombulus, and they will need to be driven back before this area will be ready for construction. I don't have anyone able to do that fight, so I need Zulf Maddox around, and I need to be around. Like, we need two high level people to clear that area. Under attack, so we can't do that area. Let's try clearing a different one. Transfer the crew to the fleet. Now, I could begin trying to deploy one of these drones here. But... Uh, it will take days to do that. I really just want to collect all the, all the stuff that's around here instead. Found 17 fuel. Oh, wonderful. For for good events. Grab all the materials as well. I'm a little nervous about that fleet, but it's not doing anything. Thirty dark matter from Nadir. I will acknowledge that. What level are you, Nadir? How many hit points do you have? 120? What are your ground abilities? Oh, they're right here. Uh, invasive surgery. Mass paranoia. 
Oh, you you don't heal? You have no healing abilities. You have no healing abilities, and you inflict... I think that's the slow? No, it's a, um, I actually don't know what that symbol is. Shocked is the slowing down. Confused is minus dodge. Can you take advantage of confused? Oh, there's no exploits here. It just inflicts. Is that right? Flicks and flicks and flicks. No, there is exploits. Blinded, but no one, none of my people have blinded. Okay, let's wait until we have people back and we can try clearing one of these rooms. By having you around as well, Nadir, I have a chance to maybe de defeat whatever's in this room, though we don't have a healer with us. That would be me who needs to come along for that. Oh god, sir, we have an incoming hypercast from the Collective. Hi, Terran friends! Hope you're holding on okay in that ungainly station of yours. So, I sent this hypercast as a favor. Nothing too pressing. But it would be really great of you to help me out on this. It turns out an aggressive identity matrix embedded from a few centuries back managed to hold itself up into a handful of my bio-vessels, which wouldn't normally be a problem. But a re-optimization of my bio-vessel placements sort of led them to coalescing on the same few ships of one of my fleets. Long story short, I partitioned off one of my fleets and it's now super hostile to humans. So, just giving you a heads up. If you can handle it, uh, that would be great. I would, but I'd rather not risk the Matrix spreading any in any manner. Because, you know, I'm getting along with my neighbors, especially my human ones. Anyway, let me know one way or another. The Collective will be expecting an answer. What shall I hypercast back to it? I accept the mission. Thanks! That'd be really sweet of you. Oh man, where is this enemy fleet? Is this it? That's it. Oh god, that's a tier 3 and two tier 1s. Transfer materials to the fleet. We're going to leave the system and immediately recall this back to base so we can deal with the collective request. Although we'll set we'll stop by here cuz it's on the way home. Commander, we cleared up that section you asked for. Acknowledged. Perfect. Transfer the crew to the fleet. Leave the system. Go to our base, and I would like to build something here. Uh, do I, I don't need power yet, and we don't need any more fuel. And I don't think I don't think we need energy multipliers either. I like to research something. We'll make up for a tiny bit of dark matter with what we've with what we're pulling back to the base right now. So much dark matter. <laughs> so much dark matter. Oh, we can try the ship repair bay. Okay, let's let's first off take the Psy Sorcerer over here as a ship I want to be able to research. Because I want I'm gonna want the tier three of that. And then well, that was all the kind of dark matter, Tim. That was a hundred dark matter right there. I don't know what to take. I wish there was some way I can convert materials into dark matter to help me with this sort of thing. I don't see anything available to me here, obviously. So... Uh, I really... I don't need cadets anymore. I need something stronger. But I bet you it's going to cost dark matter to research that. And I need... How much do I need for this again? 600. No, I really can't afford it. We need to know how expensive tier 3 ships are. Look at all the things which are filled up. And it won't really matter. Because I've got to do that one mission. Rogue to partition. Oh, that's them. Oh, I see. We have to build a troll lab next. We have to. Okay, so... Oh, hello. We have a portal. 
And a bunch of tier 2s are there. I think this might be a tier 3, the Vanguard. Oh, God. All right. Let's, um... Let's send the fleet here. And I'm going to actually evacuate that facility. Continue replication for me, Zulf. Actually, wait. Did, did I continue replication? I should have. Yes, I did. And I'm almost done. And then... I guess... I want to. I want to. I want all my captains to try to clear this that area. Transfer the crew, and I think I'm going to evacuate this facility. Yep, we're evacuating it. It's too close to troll uh, to cr uh, trolls, and I don't feel like having to worry about losing those people. The fuel, I'll take a risk and leave it there at the moment. I have... I'll have two tier two ships. Oh, hello! Uh-oh. That is a tier one, a tier two, and maybe another tier one? Let's assemble a fleet. I'm really quick to deal with what's coming our way from the... from the Zlar. Crap. <laughs> wasn't really ready for this. Um... You three are out, so I've only got one, two, three ships. And that's if I stop working. How far am I into my matter replication? Uh, I'm gonna wait. We'll see how bad this is. We'll see how bad this is. Good. Uh, let's acknowledge that, and now we can launch a fleet here. No solicitors. How do I spell solicitor? I don't. I don't know if that's correct. Cassandra, I'm sure you'll tell me how wrong I am as usual when it comes to naming things. Right, this is Stark is ready to go. Cool angels coming along, and lottery's luck is as well. Let's launch this fleet to meet our Zlar neighbors. A Tsar fleet has entered our sector, sir. They're hailing us, but first they took up artillery position. Telling. Zlar surrogate captain. Yanthu supporting Terran dogs! You will hand over that station immediately. Why do you want the station? Only the mighty Zlar Pasgadade deserve the incredible power of the precursor station. How's that rebellion going? Ever since taking power, the Tsar Yanthu Directorate has oppressed our genetic lineage. Now it is the Pregasatare's turn to conquer. Now you will give in to our demands, or should we bombard your living quarters until all your crew members, tiny insect-like, begin spewing out of the fissures we create? I reject your, your command, your demand. And we are here to stop you. Let's see how well we do. We are all going first, which makes me nervous. So let's use Spin Maneuver to get Weapons Disruption on all of them. Wow, none of them got hit by it. That was an utter waste. Let's use Protective Field then. And then, I think... I don't know what to do. Let's use Drone Swarm. Couldn't be avoided. Oh god! Going after my science vessels. I'm fine with that. Let's siphon Dark Matter. We'll try an adaptive armor. I 
guess we'll try a sol Solar Flare on the Ascensus. I like the names of these ships. I like the look of them, too. We'll then hold breach the... Ah, uh, the little guy. Blood Wrath. The Zlar on the verge of death devote everything to taking their foe along to the grave. Blood Rage. The Zlar channel their rage at being damaged into increased damage. That's incredible. Good job, Michael Janus. Looks like we've got this one in the bag now. Who's going next? It's hard for me to tell. Okay, he's going next, so I don't want to hit him because he'll get angry. I don't feel like having to deal with extra damage. Let's just heal. And now, let's try disabling this ship. Now we have to kill it because he's furious, so he's disabled, but he's going to go really soon. I could just flak barrage him to do a ton of damage and then try to finish him off. That was fun. Nice of the dark matter. We really needed that. Okay. This fleet may be able to handle that fleet, so... The real trick is, can the rank 1 science vessels survive? And Nadir, you leveled up to rank 4. Congratulations. Oh, we can now give you the tier 2 vessel instead. Oh, Spin Weaver exploits weapons disruption. Doesn't put it on it. On it. So, let's just take Scythe and Dark Matter. I like all those abilities, so he's going to take everything. We'll return this... F yeah, that they're going back to our base. And then we will send that fleet out here. But it'll be a new fleet? It's, it's actually going to be no solicitors. But I don't want... Oh, wait... No, Tim, you would want an ent oh no, let's do it. Let's do it with this fleet. We should we should be able to handle this. Everyone gets repaired and we head back out for more dark matter. Transfer the crew to the fleet. Leave the system. And we turn this fleet home. Oh hello! Hello, Yabling! Sir, a Yabbling fleet has entered a facility. They're hailing us. Well, well, well. Good to see you again, human. Remnant leader. I have some bad news for you. We recently did an audit on outstanding debt obligations, and you were stunned to realize that debt that your Federation government was meant to repay four yabs ago simply never got paid off. How much does New Terra owe? It turns out you owe the central... Yeah, bank 40,000 materials. Wait, how are we liable for New Terra's loan? Well, that's easy. You're the Federation still, dumb it? Just because you're experiencing an onset catastrophic <laughs> catastrophe that threatens your race's existence doesn't free you from debt obligations. Think of the moral hazard that might cause. Now, normally we'd stip you offer to seize some of your collateral, say a planet or two, but we'd rather not have to face any of those flesh aliens, frankly. Wow. So what do you want from us? Now, we aren't going to be unreasonable. Oh, we could take the payment in monthly installments for the foreseeable future. Or you could opt to fight our collection fleet. Wait. We just fight your fleet? Wow, you humans really don't like reading the fine print, do you? Economics isn't our strong suit. Yabbing Law stipulates that if the Extinction Event Race Clause in Section 333 is invoked, then the Debitor Race can invoke a trial by combat. Try by combat. Really? Yes! Yeesh, Terrans make it sound so complicated. The rules are very simple. Anyway, uh, the choice is up to you. 
Do you want to pay the monthly fee? Or fight the yabbling feet? We will fight. <sighs> Fair enough. This will degrade your credit score, though. Just letting you know. Oh, they're staying there. Then we'll hit them with the fleet that's returning to base. Oh god, and pirates are showing up! What the heck is going on? What's in this? Oh, this must be the fleet that they were talking about. Pirate? No, that's a pirate mining fleet! This is the debit... What the heck is going on? I may need to be called this fleet back to base. Alright, let's... Send... Oh, man. Okay. <laughs> you guys are go... Passive-aggressive response. You're gonna take care of the yabblings who are right here. Sir, a small pirate delegation has arrived nearby. I'm passing it through now. This is Lieutenant Star Stabber reporting on behalf of the Admirex. What can I do for you, Lieutenant Star Stabber? An important facility has been cornered by the Troll Fleet and is in danger of being overrun. The Admirex sent me here to request aid against our mutual enemy, with the warning that if this facility falls, it could greatly hinder our war preparedness in the future. I will accept your quest. Good. I'll let the Admirax know. Where was this enemy fleet? Tier 2s. Okay, we'll have to deal with that after we're done dealing with the collective. Let's start the fight. Yabbing fleet. The cheerful yabblings aren't often pushed to hostilities, but something happened to set these ones against you. Prepare to get slimed. Are these slime cannons? Oh, oh god. Oh, Jesus Christ! Stop hitting my ships! Wow! That really hurts! And we're not gonna probably hurt them nearly as much. And they're going next! We've lost! I think we've lost. Wow! Please stop critically hitting us! <laughs> Holy crap! <laughs> and they're going again! Um... Wow! Please destroy them or something! I need I need to keep healing with your ship, Hyven. I need to kill a ship on their side. I have to. Wow, they're going again, all of them. I have to slow them down. I have to. <laughs> Haven't you had to repair yourself? Can we just kill it? Then we kill it. Wow. I'll have to remember this for the future. Yabbling ships are terrible to fight against. Sir, we received a receipt on the debt obligation cancelization from the Yabbling Credit Authority. Following our trial by combat, they are now satisfied. Awesome. We gained some materials. Let's return you guys home. <laughs> we can think about what we're doing next. Oh, God. So, I cannot fight this group with what I've got here. I need one of these vessels. How long do I have to complete that mission? Oh, it must be a notification? 
No, we gained Crewman Chekhov. Cruel Angel is now experienced with some more aim. That's good. Right, we've got to deal with that, but I need a science vessel back at my base. So that will take a few days. So while we're waiting, we let's... Oh, we have enough to research. So we're immediately going to research Tier 3 ships. And then I have to build the structure. The hangar has to be built to support them. Oh, we're just... Oh, wow. We need energy for that as well. Okay, then. So then we will build a... Another trilithium reactor. And now we need more materials. So we might as well do matter replication three. And everyone's unavailable? Oh, the ship hasn't quite made it back to base yet. Now it has. Alright, so Crusader Kassan? No. I'd like to say nay. No. It's Hyben. Hyben, you can go ahead and do this. It'll take five days. And then... Crusader Cassandra, I'd like to say nay. I don't want you to go here. You might survive. Wait, did I not... Did I not do this? I want to add an officer. Hyben, confirm task. So, can I survive this battle with my three people? Let's, let's not do anything. Oh, yeah, let's not do anything rash. Let's just go here and do this fight. The half-robotic, half-organic collective are a normally peaceful race. Though from time to time, they sometimes ex exude psychopathic tendencies. This seems to be one of those occasions. They're slow, but probably very strong. So... What's their dodgy? Are they dodgy? They're not that dodgy. And your ship will be going again, Nadir. So let's inflict crew panic on a small one. The Firewall. What great names for ships. This is awesome. Let's then upload a virus. And they're very they're not resistant to this at all. That's wonderful. And then let's use drone swarm. And they're they've all got deconstruct on them. Let's then disable the big one. Oh, God! Critical hit! This is me who's up. They've all got Solar Flare on him. Let's use Protective Field. You can use Scythe and Dark Matter on the big guy. Sure, we'll use another solar flare on the big guy, because he's going to be around for a while. Let's use your pair drone overdrive to keep our little guy healed. Your ship needs to be healed in the air. And then... Let's... Disruptor beam? The little one? We'll try to kill that mine layer. I think then we'll try a crew panic on this one next. We'll siphon as well. Let's use Elb out of armor. Will start healing us and taking more defense. Let's exploit that crew panic and disable this guy. We'll 
corduroys the hole up here. Ship healed, Mr. Janice. Weapons. Just, uh, which do I want to use? What does more damage? He's resistant to holes and holes breach. Then we'll just use an incisor beam. Let's use a salvage harpoon on him. Upload a virus back to him again. Try to keep his accuracy a little lower. Stun him. Uh, he's resistant to hole breaches, so I guess we'll just use Flak Rage. Protect the field again. Just keep up with the incisor beams. Uh, this isn't so scary. We can repair that with the Kodoroi's hull. Sight from dark matter, actually, as well. Then we'll just keep hitting them. Keep using incisor beams. It's a good experience for Nader's ship as well. Keep the solar flare on it. I definitely want it having its aim off, just in case we can take advantage of that. I think we're going to heal that before we leave the, the battle. And that'll do it. Wonderful. The Collective has detected the destruction of its erstwhile components and are hypercasting us again. Perfect. Scary stuff, right? Anyway, great on that ancient, psychotic version of me isn't around to propagate, right? I'll definitely send some materials your way. You humans love materials, after all. No, we love dark matter. Thanks again, buddy. No problem. I'll take the materials. That it, they are helpful. Returning you guys home. Stop. Let's take a look at our base really quick. What are we doing here? Nothing. And I'm not... I'm not comfortable enough to attack that room. We could try clearing another room while we're waiting. With Night Who Say Nay. Six days... No, I'm not going to do that. I need to take care of the troll that are down south, causing chaos for the pirates, That these tier twos. So let's get this fleet back. And then we'll take care of this fleet, and then we'll wait and see if anything spawns from this one. We'll go out and collect some things, and we'll actually work on the drone stuff, too. How's our five days left until we can actually build something? So since we're sending Knight, uh, actually it should be Cassandra who goes, she needs the experience. If I was to assemble that, that fleet, what would that look like? If I was to, to send a new fleet, what would that fleet look like? So, go ship MK2, you are really badly beat up, you're just going to be sitting around waiting. So who would come along? Oh, only the ships docked here are visible to me. Okay, then I'm just going to wait. I need to watch what's happening up here, too. 75 materials. That's wonderful. I will... You can continue your replication. Okay, we are back home. So, we've got people already finished... I need to build these drones, I have to worry about the troll fleets that are around and defeat them. We have to build the troll lab as well. We have to deal with this nonsense first. So let's do this. 
So let's send the fleet here immediately. And we want... We'll make this no solicitors. So I'm thinking Alyssa Stark, you will definitely come along. And we're going to reassign Hat Hater... Nadir, sorry about that. Off of my old ship, Lottery's Luck. Where are you? So we're going to move the officer from this ship. I'm going to remove myself from Cruel Angel. Please tell me I didn't hit, like, scrap ship. Okay, good. Now we'll assign an officer. The deer. You can come along. Next. Let's save the game. We haven't saved the game in a little bit now. I've taken quite a few risks. Don't want anything bad to happen. Okay, that's good. Oh, by the way, everyone. Thank you very much for being so accepting of me taking the uploads down a notch, or several notches, as the case may be. And I apologize for not uploading anything uh, over the weekend, as it were. Um, it was a beautiful weekend. I went out, uh, well, it was raining, actually, but I still went out because I, I love that stuff. A friend of mine also was getting married, and I just had to do a bunch of stuff around the house. So, real life took over, and I didn't have anything pre-recorded, but, ah, uh, it was a nice, relaxing weekend anyway. So, and thank you guys for understanding that st sort of stuff, too. Alright, that's enough of that. Let's get out here and send a fleet. So this Stark is coming along. I think we'll send the Dragon's Talon because it requires no repairing. In addition to that, you take advantage of Vulnerable? Oh, only with Teleport Explosives. But you can also put engines down on them. Cassandra, can you put engines down on something with Special Snowflake? I don't think you can. Oh, but you can better take advantage of Vulnerable. You also inflict Weapons Disruption. You know what? We will, we will try this. We'll try this fleet. So we'll repair Special Snowflake, because I do need you level 7 as well. And then Cruel Angel's coming along with Nadir. We will launch that fleet. Meanwhile, back here, I still need more matter creation. I have a single level 7. Ivan, you're busy doing stuff. How much? Five days left? Why don't we build another drone? We'll want another one. I know it's 350. I probably shouldn't do it, but we're gonna anyway. 11 days for this. All right, let's do it. The pirates have asked you to save an important facility from the troll. Let's do it. Hello, guys. How are you doing? So, I like starting with sensors offline to try to get their aim down. So let's do that to start. <laughs> Next. Let's use Drone Swarm. It's our epic ability. We're going right back to the base after this is done, so there's no reason not to. They did not like that, which is fine with me. Now, nothing has Vulnerable on it. You don't have a Engines down on you, Cassandra. So let's try a Disabling Strike on one of the big guys who hasn't gone yet. Let's use it on the one who doesn't have his aim penalty. We're taking big hits. Let's use... Oh, that's right. Albat of Armor was on the other ship. Let's Dark Matter Extraction on the Elder Ghast. We'll try to take that one out first. Oh, Jesus. We're taking lots of damage up there. And you're not going until some time has passed. Let's use a suicide run to try to disable one of these guys. I'm then going to need to... I need to heal. So let's use Cauterize Hole. Let's then... I need to take out the... This one's probably going to Brood Pods itself. Honestly. Can I do... You have a Vulnerable. I'd like to get that on something. 
good oh, I was going to say good dodge, but you didn't actually dodge. Don't want a bullseye? Yes. Oh god! I forgot all about bowling ball. Let's protect the field. And then you can be paired. Uh, I think you'll still be okay, Mr. Janus. Let's release some mines. Kill the one that's already hurt up there. Let's try a bridge shot. Resisted. I can't kill it before it goes. Unless I disable it. But then you have to heal yourself up there, Michael Janus. So we'll heal you instead to keep you around. Oh, God! Let's, re let's use Paragon Overdrive. I think that was a crit and, explo and an exploitation there. I would love to kill it. I can't do it with just two of us. He resisted it. That sucks. God. Quarter raise the hole. We're almost out of healing stuff, actually. In fact, we, we are effectively out of it. Just kill one of them, please. Then, let's siphon dark matter. I can try weapons disruption on this one. Still resisting it. We'll use a salvage harpoon. Oh, darn you. That was awesome. Good work. Try a suicide run to this evil. Can I kill it? No. But we'll try. Very good critical hit. Just one left. We probably have won this. Let's try getting a weapon disruption on him anyway. And then we can exploit that with a status lock and try stunning him. And then finish him off. Whew! Good work, team. Sir, our fleets beat back the troll vessels in the system, but the pirate facility seems infected with a similar substance we discovered on Nutera. The pirates plead with you to do something to save their facility. Jury rig controlled heat explosion. The pirates impressed with your Federation level technological problem solving draw plans to retake the station. They thank you for helping them. Awesome. Claim the station's resources. In exchange for saving their station, you claim the reserve materials stored there. Pirates are a little miffed. Too close, too close for missiles, switching the gun. Michael Janice, you gained plus 10% damage. And you leveled up. Let's view your profile and see what we're taking with you. I think we need another ground ability.
Suppose we could just take drone takedown. Another rank and immediately be just that'll be the ability we use every round. Yeah, let's take drone takedown three. Sorry, Pirates, but we need we need stuff to make up for what we, we just did there. Let's return these guys home. And how are we looking on our base? We need another room cleared. We'll have to clear this room once people are back. And you leveled up. Cassandra, congratulations on your own stuff. So let's take... Let's take Bridge Shot up another rank. Back home. Okay, so we're badly hurt. I could really use better repairs, but I need to clear stuff first. Let's actually save the game and we'll try clearing that one room out. Alright, let's 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 do this. So, we need to clear this room. Grumbler's birthing grounds. So... Cassandra? Actually, I need to look at our, our people first, don't I? So, Cassandra, what do you have? Bleeding, explosed, inflicts stealth. You inflict exposed, and you take advantage of exposed? You do. Okay, perfect. So, you two are definitely coming along. I'm not around, though. I'm not here for five days. The deer leveled up. Congratulations, deer. Um, well, we're going for a ground combat. We, let's let's try to take advantage of that while we're here. We're, it's, it's just going to be a damage group as well. Do I want isotopes? I kind of want a single. This is really nice. That is a really nice ability. But it would also affect these two abilities affect all enemies. These affect single enemies. What else do you have, Cassandra? We just inflict a bunch of stuff. Does anyone exploit something? Blinded. But that's it. Alright then, let's take... Oh, we can exploit Shocked. Alright, let's take an in invasive surgery. Let's try clearing this room. Oh, 12 days to clear the chamber. Wow. Hyman has successfully replicated 25 materials in the chamber. Let's acknowledge that. Do I want to reassign him? I think I do. Yeah, Hyman, I think you're just going to be doing that for a little bit. Because I'm expecting to do a battle in that... Uh, room, so I don't want to send you out to do anything. So you'll just continue with the matter rep replication. And Caesar wept. Trilithium reactor online. Show the location. Plus 30 power. Excellent. Now, we, ha we have enough to build a tier 3 starship hangar. We shall do so. And then we need probably a ton of dark matter. Our people are busy. I'm ex fully expecting us to fight some stuff in here. So I kind of want Michael Janice and the deer to be around. While we wait. And for research, we still have to be able to research the tier 3 vessels as well. We've got dark matter that's sitting around out here. So we need to collect this. Darn it. I can't... I can't do that. Okay. I can't do that at the moment. I would want two ships to head out. Okay. Let's cancel this task. We can clear that room later. 
And let's also cancel one other task. Hyben, we're not going to have you do this. We are instead going to make a fleet, and we'll take care of some more material gathering. And I think I'll do that off-screen as well, everyone. I'm just going to do a sweep here, claim all the stuff, and if the troll launch a fleet, I'll then start recording, and we'll deal with that, because I have a bunch of... I have tons of stuff just still sitting around. So, yeah, so we'll send out a normal fleet. It'll probably consist of Hyben, Crusader Cassandra, and Nadir. They'll head out and collect a bunch of stuff, and once again, I'll do that off-screen. And I'll see you guys in the next video, where we'll struggle to get more dark matter. And I'll see you guys then. Take care, and thanks for watching.